Here we go. Here we go. What up, what up, what up? Here we go, here we go. We up, we up today, we up, we up. <sighs> got some kind of hype. You know, I see got my shirt off. You know what I'm saying? Just got back from my workout. It's been a stressful morning. I don't did a two-hour interview this morning, and they, I'm still, like, swell because of that. The motherfuckers, like, drill me for a whole hour about this snitching shit, yo. Like, you know, I don't really like talking about that shit because I'm trying to move on towards my project, but, you know, shit, he paying, you know what I'm saying? So... I already, you know, if he ain't see it on, I guess he ain't get what he wanted to get out of the Danny Diamond. I mean, out of the uh, Doggy Diamond's uh, interview. So, um, for a straight hour, this nigga drill me about this snitching shit, man. <laughs> like, but, you know, it's, it's his money, his work. He put the research into it. But, you know, I like that he did that because he knew a lot more than everybody else because he, he like dug into a lot of shit. So, you know, I'm, I'm glad he did that kind of research. Um, and, uh, and, uh, and the bottom line is, you know, the questions that he was asking me sort of, you know, like, you know, what took it to this level and, and, and why, you know, what's, why this social media, why are we going through this channels? And I was like, you know, that's, I was so frustrated. So I'm like, yo, yo listen, dude, do you think he could have called me a snitch and be out here on the street and you think we would be doing this? If he, somebody called me a snitch or if he called me a snitch and this was on the streets, you think we would be doing this? Of course not. You know what I'm saying? This right here was, um, to me, is a level of platform that he can get the message that you trying to send or whatever you trying to get out there. It's just like you on a playing field now with this technology and doing this through social media. Same shit. Album, whether they talk about you on record, this and that and the third. But I had to let them know, like, yo, Duke, if this shit was on some street shit and it was real, um, we wouldn't be doing this. You know what I'm saying? We'd be handling business other ways, the way it's supposed to be handled. So at the end of the day, this is just a platform to get my voice out there and shit. You know what I'm saying? To get me heard from, you know, get me cleared from that shit. So anyway, that shit got me tight, all that snitch talk and shit. Um, you know, um, it was real interesting, man. I think we, uh, in that interview, I said some things definitely that y'all uh, that y'all probably missed in, uh, on the Doggy Diamonds. And, and it, it go a little bit deeper into that snitch and shit because um, he even talked about, um, you know, it's an awkward situation for some people. And, and, um, and I was like, what you mean? Um... He spoke to say he said something like, "If Emery's my co-defendant and Jay called me a snitch, isn't that an awkward position that Emery would be in?" You know what I'm saying? Like, and I'm like, "What do you mean an awkward position?" He like, "Yeah, because Emery is your co-defendant and he know the truth about what's going on." And I'm like, "Yeah, and what's the awkward position?" He was like, "Well, they could just ask Emery and Emery know." And I'm like, who could ask Emery? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, what person don't want their job? What person don't want to fucking be around them ever again asking some questions like that? Like, on some real shit. You think nigga really holler at one of them niggas and go, yo, is the Haven a snitch? Is this shit real? You know what I'm saying? I'm asking you because you was co-defendant and Jay said this. You know what I'm saying? So that, 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 um, that interview was really, really deep. You know, that shit was, that shit was cool. Shout out to them, but like I said, um, really don't want to speak about them because they got to finish paying. Um, so <laughs> that's gonna be hard. Um, shout out to them, you know. Um, anyway, to move on with my day, man, because I was hyped. Like I said, the Kickstarter didn't work, but so many I'm getting so much help on the side, you know, on the outcome of that. That shit is beautiful. Like stuff that I know I was gonna need the money for. That shit is coming out, you know, with people that for the love and, and the help. And I appreciate it. Um, so that's what it is. And, and my team, is that shit just made my team more hungry, yo. Shout out to Industry Labs, man. Like, y'all stuck with me from day one. Y'all jumped on this shit. Um, Baines, Tone, like, Rao, you know, this trust level we have for each other with this project, man, I appreciate you guys, man. And I appreciate, I really do. And um, it's going to happen. Um, 
So yeah, man, that shit just energized them, and I'm glad, man. They got they working their ass off now to to give y'all something. I could guarantee, man. This next this next thing that comes that we release or put out there, man, this shit is gonna definitely um do some do some um you know make it happen. Um, okay, let's talk about my. I wanted to get at this shit on my post. Um, you see, I post that 145th shit. You know, the day I was up there and I said a little story about things. And here we go with the hater shit. My man, Sneakers, City Sneakers, that's with two S's. I told y'all niggas about your fucking mouths and all that corny hating shit. You know what I'm saying? He put up a post saying, yo, you know, all that talk I was talking about, copping bricks on 145th. So he says, yo, you know, but you copping an eight ball now. I'm like, all right, that's the joke. I'm copping an eight ball now. So I have to let you know, City Sneakers, if I got an eight ball to date, by September 1st, nigga, I have triple your life savings, throw your ugly chick in too, um, and uh, with, her, with, with, with her welfare shit, and, you know, put all, your, all that shit in there, and I'll, put, I'll, surpass, I'll surpass you in, by September 1st. If that's starting out with an eight ball if I chose to live that dumbass life. You know what I'm saying? So... You could take that. Like I said, nigga, if I take an eight ball a day, nigga, in September, I have twice your life savings with your ugly chick. So keep that moving. Um, good luck, homie. Uh, you know, I hope it gets off the ground. This project been off the ground, man. This shit is on wheels, man. We pushing, you know, we just doing, we pushing it now. And it's getting lighter and lighter on the push. So, you know, we cool with that. You feel what I'm saying? We all good with that. Um... Like I said, and I'm happy where we at, man, because it's like they thought of some new shit that I couldn't think of, man, and that's what a team is all about, yo. Um, so, you know, I don't believe in luck, man. We just got to put in the work. Um, Trenton, the artists, man, just some um, bars and hooks, man. I wish you got to understand, man. Listen, am I supposed to listen? Artists, rappers, listen to this shit. Listen, this is my all day, every day thing, right? You think I'm gonna listen to eight tracks of your music, all eight of them, and I'm listening, you know, uh, tons and tons of music, tons of fucking music in my DM. Shit is banging. Some of you, I believe, you know, I believe some of you are Jay. I believe y'all got talent, y'all. I understand, I get it, you know what I'm saying? Your shit is banging. But you got to go about this the right way. I posted up some information, man, for you guys in Trenton to put your information up. Give Tony your information. And then I'm, I'll, show, I'll, I'll be in Trenton to let you know what this is about, what kind of platform it is. But you got to do shit the right way, man. Um, like I said, it's banging music. What do y'all want me to do? Like, what do y'all want me to do? Like, it's your dope. It's your product. And y'all don't know how to sell this shit or something, man. Y'all sitting on the product and you want me to sell it, it seems like. You know what I'm saying? Um, I'm trying to do provide all the help I can, you know. You know what I'm saying? I, I really am. But at some point, man, one thing for sure, man, you guys got to definitely put money into your careers, man. Ain't nobody handing shit to you. You got to put some money into your fucking self. I mean, everybody, uh, listen. What your man say? I'm quite sure you all follow. A lot of y'all follow Emery and J2 and this and that. And I follow them niggas. You know what I'm saying? So, it, it, you know, it's still what it is what it is. Bet on yourself. Okay? That's exactly how they look going around and promoting. Betting on yourself, yo. And I see a lot of y'all young artists. Y'all ain't putting no money into your career, yo. Um, ain't nobody hand. That shit is a dream or a luck lottery what you see going on in these internet and these industries, how these niggas are getting on. So don't believe that shit, man. Y'all niggas need to definitely put some money into y'all career, man. You got the dope. You just ain't selling it. If your shit is hot, you know what I'm saying? Sell it. Sell it. You got the fucking top product. Sell that shit, man. That's what, Hustle your shit. That's your product, yo. You know what I'm saying? Like, you guys need a lesson, man, and, and one-on-one lesson in this marketing and promotion and trying to sell your product, man. And, and, and I'm like, I'm all for helping out, bro, but if I got to commit my time to it, and my time is money, 
You know what I'm saying? So I don't have that, you know, I can't just look, do, do things for everybody. I can open up some doors and some doors open up and this and that and the third, but you know, listen to your music. I'm not, you know, I just can't do it, man. I just can't do all the music shit. If you do it the right way, I'm trying to give y'all an example to do it the right way and set up a good platform for you. You know what I'm saying? Just follow the rules, man, and, and I can make it happen as best as I can. I'm gonna ride with you. Um, so yeah, man, that's what I wanted to tell you, man. You, you guys are lazy, man. And half of the rappers that say they, they hard, and I, like I said, I done this shit. I rode around the block, and I, and I asked niggas, I, like, yo, you got some on you? You got some music on you I can buy? A fucking thumb drive, a single, something I can buy right now? And them niggas was looking crazy in the face. So that right there let me know that these niggas don't take their own shit serious. They'll sell weed, dope, coke, they'll sell Pills, they'll sell fucking all the things but they can sell but their own fucking product, which is the music. So, you know, and this is this is the opportunity, like nobody can stop you from selling this shit. You know what I'm saying? What I can offer is a platform, man. I got a hard platform for you, man, with this project of mine's coming out, with this series. It's gonna be music. So it's a platform. You know what I'm saying? Um, and use it. You know what I'm saying? Just follow my lead, yo. A lot of y'all don't know shit, yo. And I'm gonna do. That's why a lot of older niggas are getting into this. I ain't gonna lie. A lot of older niggas are getting into this because see, they see that y'all not about y'all fucking business, yo. Y'all don't want to read shit, you know what I'm saying? And y'all not about y'all business. So that's why a lot of older niggas are really tapping into this shit because they see the paperwork that's into this, and they gotta do, you know, put in some extra work. They see it, and then you know half of y'all that want the handout when y'all get the handout. And y'all get something, next thing you know, you feel like you're getting raped for your money. You know what I'm saying? So learn this shit, man. You know what I'm saying? Learn this shit. Learn this shit well. And I, and I see this constantly, man, that y'all don't know the business of this shit, man. Because honestly, you the hardest, you the hardest rapper and your shit is tight. Why are you not selling this shit, yo? That's the product. You know what I'm saying? So I'm going to move on, man. My product is my story, my movie. That's the only thing I want to sell. You know what I'm saying? I got other hustles. I got other money into shit that makes money faster than my, than my project. But my ending goal is my project. You know what I'm saying? So you got to have other hustles and shit. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, it, this shit is like, it's, it's just like the fucking drug game, man. You got product. You sell that shit and you re-up. You sell that shit. You keep re-ing up until they fucking, you all over the airways. That's it. Nobody can fucking stop you. I know I seem hype and shit, but you know, that shit be making me tight because I see the laziness, man, and I be out here and shit, you know what I mean? And, they, and you want me to help, if you want, but you want me to do 90% of the help, yo. That's no good. It's no good, not for where I'm going, you know, especially if you ain't in my direction, you know what I'm saying? And I pay for information. I pay for knowledge. I pay for this shit. You know what I'm saying? So why well, I'ma keep giving it away for free, trying to help people and shit, and, I, and I'm paying for it. You know what I'm saying? So end of the day, man, I'm really big on this thing, just trending this weekend, man. I'm hoping enough people, Tone tell me enough people sign up. Um, it's only gonna be 10. It's a good platform, like I said. Um, use this shit. I see you guys, I think it's Saturday or Sunday morning. I, let, I post it up tomorrow. Um, I'm looking forward to this shit, man. It's hot. Now I'm tight. But um, what else I want to talk about? You know, I didn't want to talk about that snitching shit because you know I want to. Move, I'm moving on past that shit. But hey, that's a paid interview, so I, I rock with it. You know. Um, other than that, um, shout out to uh, like I said, Industry Lives, man. I mean, I don't know, man. This next move gonna be a power move. I appreciate you guys working hard. Tone, um, the bars and hooks shit gonna work out, man. Trust me, um, we got that. And that's it, man. That's all I had to say. Um, what else I'm talking about, man? I don't be in the media, so I can't tell you what the, what's going on and who's arguing with who and all this other shit. Um, Cause I be worried about my shit, man, and, and, and what I can what I could do and who I could help sometimes, yo. That's most of my fucking day be like, you know, what benefits me? Uh, if I could benefit somebody that helps us benefit it together, all of that shit, that's what my days be about. Shout out, to, oh, damn, man, you said 
Doggy Diamonds is a herd, man. Why you bringing that negative shit to my shit, bro? Damn, bro. Y'all, I mean, y'all do, this is what y'all day be like, yo? Really? The nigga trying to do, he wasn't feeling the Doggy Diamonds interview. All right, if you wasn't feeling it, you know what I'm saying? That's just your opinion, dude. You know what I'm saying? That's just your opinion, but you ain't got to call a nigga out, man. This respect thing, man. This shit is just, I don't know where y'all be going with this shit, man. This is why I stay like this. You see this shit? This is why I stay like this, because, I mean, you're going to need to come correct with that bullshit, man. And ain't nobody got time for that, yo. You know what I'm saying? We all men. Say men, you know, say respectful shit and you get respectful shit, man. Niggas ain't out here with that shit, man. Niggas trying to do the same thing that the industry doing and get paid for their shit. The new interview you did on the podcast. What about it? But um, like I said, man, you hating guys, man. I, don't, I hope people use that as energy like I do, man, because y'all motherfuckers don't sleep. So y'all keep me awake and keep me on my game. Um, like I said, my, uh, shout out to everybody that's been supporting me, man. We still, I'm still trying to do this 10,000, man. Pass my stories on. Um, we should be doing this 10,000 at least in another week, man. But, you know, I need that 10,000 hard earned, man. Followers and shit. To me, that's a goal. Um, that's, that's a goal for me, man. For real, to put in 10,000 followers with, without buying none and cheating and doing all that other wild shit. Just... Just showing what social media can do and how it can spread. Um, other than that, man, I'll see you guys later. Um, give you guys an update on what's going on. I'm back to work. I really want to put something out fast, you know what I'm saying? But uh, I'm waiting on my peoples to get this shit together. Y'all got them working hard. Get off Jay Dick, nigga, and own your own story because he ain't living in the past. He grew up. Die, nigga. Die, old nigga. A word? Wait, well, who's that? Polite, 904, yo. That's how you feel? Get off J-Nuts, huh? That's the shit that I be dealing with. See? See what the internet do? They come in all sizes and shape. Now, this nigga could be in Alaska in a motherfucking igloo talking shit. Some shit he had never said to me if we approached each other, if he walked by me. This is, this is how, you know, this is big boy shit. You know what I'm saying? I'm glad you get off like that, bro. I'm glad you do. I don't even erase niggas like you. I need you on my line and shit, because somebody else will say something to you. But you keep it up. I'll definitely ear your ass out. You one of them niggas anyway that probably got three followers and no life, and, and that's just what it is. And I don't know what the fuck you talking about. Peace, nigga. Uh, what else? Positive vibes, that's what I fuck with. That's all it is, man. Like, we ain't gonna, y'all not gonna catch me outside my square. It's just not gonna happen, you know? You know, I might get hot and get hot and get agitated, but I ain't gonna step out my square, you know what I'm saying? It's, I just come too far for that, you know what I mean? So, it is what it is. I'm out. Peace.